Okay, so this is our Tandy share o -matic. Um Show you some more details. Uh, the, the base and the back are built from plywood. Also the compartments here and, and the shuffle. Uh, the plastic tubing here is from, from clear acrylic plastic. Um, the wheel here is from a kick bike. Uh, then we have a small electrical motor here. Um, and I think that's about it. The motor, um, at first we opted for 5 volts, it was a little bit too fast and the candy easily got jammed. So, so we lowered uh, the voltage down to 3 volts. Um, now it spins at around uh, 5000 RPMs. Uh, the gear ratio here, we just use a simple rubber band, is roughly 1 to 55. So, so the small motor spins 55 times per one revolution of the big wheel. Here you can also see the holes in the base plates so that the shuttle, when it moves to the leftmost position, the candy uh, can drop through both holes. And then here you can see the rightmost position. One last thing I want to show you is um, how the base plate is actually fixed in place. Um, so it's actually easy to detach and you can see we just uh, also made two uh, grooves here using uh, again a handheld router. Uh, and then there are two small screws here uh, which then fix uh, the shuttle uh, in place. And it turned out to be a, a very good uh, solution. Uh, and the shuttle here for each revolution, uh, it is filled and delivers a candy into each glass. So we can see if we can show it in motion. There are two pressure switches. So two glasses need to be inserted for the machine to start. To show you the mechanism on the back so quite simple uh, the two switches here the motor and as i said just simple three volts from two triple a batteries so i hope you liked our build uh it was great fun um and we're looking forward also to the continuation of mark rober's creative engineering class over at monthly